As to Jennifer McLogan reports on the efforts there in East Meadow. Thank you for coming. Have a good day. Holiday hiring in full swing. Today is day number one. Day number one. And I love it. Corlissa Isaac is an East Meadow grandmother who decided to answer the desperate call for seasonal workers. My family is very annoyed that I'm out of the house working because they want me to run around for them. <laughs> but this is for me. Across America, the plight's the same. Businesses are handling the busiest months of the year without the workers they need. People are shopping early. And there just seems to be such a hard time trying to find people that want to work. I don't know where everybody is, but we're here if people would like to find a part time job. Funky Monkey Toys and Books in Greenvale, with signs in the window, is recruiting at colleges, using social media, offering wage increases, store discounts, and other incentives. It's definitely a job seekers market. Remote positions are really in high demand. Health concerns over the Delta variant continued disruptions of the global supply chain mean more competition for a limited supply of workers willing to take in-person jobs. Target plans to hire 100,000. Amazon recruiting 1,500. Stop and Shop needs 1,000 permanent workers. Walmart has 150,000 seasonal openings, and Stu Leonard's looking for 400 on Long Island. We did raise our minimum to start at 16 till the end of the year because we know we have to be competitive with every other retailer out there. Flexible hours, too. Corlissa wondered if she had the skills. Seasonal hiring is definitely more about attitude over aptitude. Hopefully they'll keep me. <laughs> Learn on the job. Part-time can become full-time. On Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS2 News.